Dismantled? Dismantled. Yeah, dismantled. That's the word I was looking for. We can't English. Yeah. Hey, look. What she got? What, what do it? Chips. What has it got in its pockets? Is? Well, let's see. In my pockets is today, Gollum. Um, <laughs> a club, a sword to cut you up, <laughs> a woodcutter's axe that you may or may not have interest in. Um. Ooh. Yeah. Look at that. Badly damaged already. Yeah. Crap. The rusty sword. And if you use your weapons needlessly, yeah, they get ruined. Who? Yeah. I wish I knew that earlier, but I'm glad I didn't. This is what I get for being the dumb. It happens. We learn as we go. Pray. The giants. That's not praying. Just put oh, my hands on my hips and looking up at the statue is praying. <laughs> yeah, really. Pushing my chest and my crotch area outward. That's oh, praying. Yeah, that. Also, Link always looks so angry. He does. He though. has rusting bitch face. Yeah. He has such a massive <laughs> rusting bitch face. That <laughs> is so true. Like, he just looks so angry all the time. Link, why? Why are you so angry? Probably because he's like, oh, I'm so angry because of these love handles and they just won't go away. The goddess smiles upon you. Yeah, but what does she do? You have to like, do the shrines. Oh, you yeah, get the four right. spirit orbs and then you go to the goddess statue and she'll give you either a heart container or a stamina vessel. So I would then you can get more stamina or more hearts. Oh, yeah, that's. Yeah, I feel like I, you had told me that before. Oops. It happens. Well, it ain't away. Like, it doesn't matter. We did that in previous recordings, so that won't matter now. <laughs> Since we're starting all over again. That's true. Uh, oh, well. Oopsie poopsie. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> it is. I remember because, like, uh, I was getting <laughs> John to start. I think it was. Whoops. We'll cut that out. Why? I don't know. I don't feel like he who should not be named would want to <laughs> mention. Uh, but, I don't know. I doubt he cares, but whatever. I don't think he does. If he does, we can just create a name for him like we did for that one guy. He just wants to be like the voice. He doesn't want to actually have his face. He just wants his voice, possibly. Wait, which one? He who should not be named. That's what I'm just gonna call him. Now. He's just he gonna be Voldemort. <laughs> <laughs> Voldemort. But not really Voldemort. He's just gonna be he who should not be named. Um. Anyway, like he was playing it, and <laughs> he's um, playing it, and like he had to ask me so many times, I'm like, what should I do? I don't understand what I need uh, to do. <laughs> Mainly just because he was just like, I don't want to try and figure it out on my own. Just show me what to do. I'm impatient. I don't want to oh, try and figure it out on my own. No. But that's like half the fun. It's uh, you know how we, you have to go to the tower or whatever. Oh like, yeah. Like, the towers erected and whatever. Like, the erect tower. <laughs> the erect towers. Uh, he goes up there, talks to the old man, and the old man tells him like, oh yeah, you gotta find the shrines you saying or she is like, he didn't do that. So he just fell. He just went down the tower, and then I told him, like, no, you're supposed to go back up to the tower and use the tower to find the shrine. So I had to do that for him, kind of ah! back up, just to do that. And then, he still was like, now what do I do? And I'm like, you go to the shrine, so you what? learn and get things. And he's like, oh, okay. <laughs> but that's, like, half the fun of playing the game. He's just impatient. I mean, I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, I definitely, for some of the puzzles, I looked them up and I was like, what do I do with this? And I was like, um... I kind of... You got pants! That's the game telling you, wear some pants! Wear some pants! Gosh! Every now and again, I'll do that too, though. Where, But I, I'll have to be on the puzzle for, like, maybe a week. And not, because that's happened before, and it honestly makes me irritated every single time. Yeah. Um, no. Ah, no cup for you, I take it. He's my cup. Ah. 
for me, it takes me like maybe like five minutes before I just get coffee, and I'm like, how do I, fix, how do, I do this? And then I'm like, oh, well, I'm stupid. <laughs> and I'm like, well, then. What this is a key? Like, especially just at the beginning. Because, like, but then after you do, like, a couple, like, whatever, 80 shrines in it. 80 like, shrines? Okay, I know what I'm doing, but it's like, yeah. Well, there's 120 different shrines, you know? So it has to have, like, 120 different ways to solve it, or 120 different puzzles, and it's like, holy crap. Nah, I feel you. Like, oh, Blonkers. OG Willikers, Batman. Aww. Adam West. <laughs> You're going to get mad every single time. Well, because I just the Robin G. Willikers Batman, and I'm like, oh, that's so sad. It's so sad that Batman is just Batman. Like, I mean, I was never a fan of the really old school Batmans, but... I, I only like them because they're so funny. They're so derpy. They are. Like, just all the crazy lines that Robin says, <laughs> like, I... Cannot help but laugh because they're just so cornball and I'm like, wow. They are really. Like, holy chocolate buns with Batman and like, holy whatever. I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> it just makes Robin like seem like such a derp. He is though. Uh, and then what was it? Shark repellent. Oh my gosh. The fact that they have shark repellent. Shark repellent. Oh, it kills me. Kills me so good. Ooh, it's blah! Oh, you missed the blah! What? Oh, there was a bug! You could have collected the bug, but instead you get raw meat! Who's better than raw meat? Nothing! What did you have some pork? I quite like some the pork. pork. Or some she shrimp? She shrimp. Or she, she chicken? <laughs> she chicken. Uh. The raw. I had to make sure we were recording audio because I forgot. Hey, look! What's this? <laughs> you got it. Ooh, flint. Flint's convenient. Because if you put, yeah, wood next to flint and then you use a metal weapon to strike the flint, it'll start fire. Okay. Do you even have a metal weapon? I guess still have my wrist. No, I don't have. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, the axe. Yeah, the axe will work. Key items. Along with your little Korok seed. What? Honestly, the Korok seeds look like little poops. <laughs> kind of. I mean, in the end, you still get a giant golden poop, but it looks like a tiny poop. I just imagine the Korok saying, like, Yeah, give it a present! Here you go! I can actually see that. I'm a Korok! I'm a Toad! Wait, so that was... I only can use Flint once? Yeah. Tips. Oh. Well, you'll find more Flint along the way. You'll I thought find. so. Or you could just be cheap. You just wanted to make a fire so you can have your torch and set everything on fire, didn't you? More or less. I figured. <laughs> Uh, why not, uh, listen to Zelda, who is now your Navi, and go to the tower? Uh, yeah. You know, I actually meant to check my Sheikah slate. <laughs> but then you're like, ooh, quiet. I know this game is, like, so, like, you're doing something, and you're like, wait, wasn't I supposed to do something? And then you're like, oh. That's right. right. So, I mean, oh, no, because, um, the new episodes of Bee and Puppy Cat, I love Bee and Puppy Cat from Cartoon Hangover. Like, uh, the new episodes it, it involves something that's very, like, Video gaming, because <laughs> for they go on a work, a temp agency work request to go to this place, and it's all video game things. So they show up, and she like selects like herself as a male character, <laughs> and then she's like the main quest to like kill this eyeball that makes everyone uncomfortable. She's like, I don't know, it's like the size of a planet, but then she's like, uh, is there anything that I can do with like like a side quest? And she goes to do all these side quests, <laughs> and boy, and you just see her go by like. While she's doing, like, giving people shovels or bringing things to other people, she walks by, like, the guy who gave her the main quest, and so he's, like, all excited, like, no oh, way! And then she walks past him, and he just gets all, like, upset. Like, Aww. I'm like, that's so true. Like, realistically, like, if, if in real life someone's like, hey, can you take care of this? Or you're like, wait, I gotta level up. I gotta go train before I can go and defeat this thing. Like, I'm pretty sure people are like, uh... It's been a while. You, you're gonna, you you're said gonna, you were gonna do it. Um, 
Oh, uh, it's so funny. But really? I should probably not do that during recording. Wow. Well, <laughs> I hear clicking from my pen. Just. I hope that bothers people. You're gonna be like, why, why? Uh. Yeah. I ruined things. I ruined a lot of things. Not as many as some people. Good point. You could be a lot worse. Yeah. I honestly wonder, you know what, they always have a new Deku tree? Yeah. I always wondered because I see like the really huge log to a giant tree. I'm like, I wonder if that was the old Deku tree. Oh. Uh, <laughs> and he died. Because uh, how many times have we seen that, like, where the old Deku, the great Deku tree dies and there's a new great Deku tree? That's actually very true. I never thought of it that way, and now I'm kind of sad. Because Wind Waker had it, and then also I think it was- <laughs> No! What are you doing? Get away from there! No shit, 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 It's a rock with no eyes, but for some reason he can see you. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> He's gonna throw his arms at you. Oh god. Oh god. <laughs> yeah, I'd go far, far away from him. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. It would suck if you made like all this far and then all of a sudden you just get hit by a rock. <laughs> you just get hit by a rock. Yeah. <laughs> that would kill you instantly. Ah, five guys. Ah, he's a fire. I am not going to use my torch. Use our club. There you go. I love that jump. Like, ah! Okay, now here's a thing I've always been confused. Like, because I know, like, in different Legends of yeah. Legends, they have Ganondorf and then they have Ganon. So I'm guessing <clears> just, like, like, why do they make Ganondorf either Ganon or Ganondorf, but Zelda and Link are always the same, typically, throughout. Like, they're always human, or... Um, I feel like Ganondorf is a different version of Ganon, if I remember right. Because what, Ganon's, like, the original? Yeah, Ganon's the original. Okay. But, it, like, but, like, here's the thing, it's like, I'm always like, why does Ganon not come back just constantly as Ganon, but they have to make, like... Because, um, the way the timeline went, um... Ganon. Oh, whoops. Um, <laughs> I think Ganon. Oh, that was on a completely different thing. Um, Ganon was a less powerful version of Ganondorf. And so, in one of the games, Ganon actually became Ganondorf, if I remember right. Or I'm probably just pulling this out of my butt and none of it's correct. Hmm. Because it's like. Because here's the thing, like, Zelda and Link are always, well, I guess they're not, because they have in some games, they're not even Hylian, sometimes Link is like a, or have they always been Hylian? I don't think they've always been Hylian, no. Because I thought, like, because technically Hylian wasn't a thing in Skyward Sword, was it? I don't believe so. I don't know. But, like, in the end, like, it always seems like, like they are, but, like, all of a sudden you guys... <clears throat> Ganon and Ganondorf, and they always come out either or, and it's like, what? Okay, now how do I get to... It's confusing. The whole timeline's confusing. Because <coughs> here's the thing that I actually wanted, like, because people are questioning, like, oh, this must take after Wind Waker in the Zelda timeline. But I'm like, how can that be if it takes after that? Because, well, the whole camera thing, because your Sheikah Slate can use yeah. a camera, and if you go to, like, Zelda's, like, research tower or whatever, like, way into, like, the game, it mentions in her journal, saying, like, oh, we never seen something that could, like, take pictures and without having to be drawn or whatever, but in Wind Waker, you do have a camera. Yeah, honestly, that, the timeline confuses me as far as that goes. Yeah. Because, like, people think that this game, like, Breath of the Wild takes after Wind Waker, but I don't know entirely if that's true. Considering, like, the she the Sheikah are the ones supposedly to come up with this camera face thing. It's the one who made the Sheikah site. But, like, in Wind Waker, you have, like, a legitimate camera. It makes sense, too, though, because the Temple of Time, if I remember Wind Waker right, is actually underwater. 
Yeah. Like, because people think, like, this is supposed to be, like, when, like, the earth or whatever is not submerged in water. Wait. Like, I went to the wrong spot. Damn it. Whoopsies. But, like, people think, like, oh, like, this is when, like, the flood is gone and there's, the world isn't covered in water anymore. Like, they think it's that point after one winter, but. Yeah. You know, we won't know until Nintendo actually admits it. And I have a feeling... It's outlandish. Yeah. I have a feeling they will not. Well, they've already mentioned that this takes after Ocarina within that timeline. That's all they've said. That makes sense. Yeah, because of the Temple of Time. Oh! Oh! Oh, relaxing. Oh, yeah, we are. He's still salty about that big dab. Don't you have somewhere else to be? No. Hint, hint, go to the tower. I'm trying to go to the tower. Well, you can't fast travel there, because you have to, whatever, erect the tower. Erect! Erect it. To make it erect. Yes. Oh, I remember. If you want to turn off the AC, you totally can. Are you cool? Smidge. Yeah, I was trying to feel it. Also, I bet the noise from the AC is probably being all cap kinds of captured. I would believe it. What? Look, a stick! Ooh, a stick! Oh, yeah! Oh, wait, no, I can't. Dang it! What? I was gonna say, I can do this entire playthrough with just a stick, but I've already used the sword. Yeah, oh. you're already doing that. <laughs> oh. And you use the club. Oh, That's well. true. Dang it. That would be so hard to play this game only using a stick. Because uh, then, like, you would never use even the Master Sword when you get So it was like, oh, uh, hey, you killed him. Yeah. Oh, it's so convenient. Yeah. <laughs> oh, just go grab their weapons. Oh, God. They're jellies. Choo choo jelly. The jellies. So like choo choo jellies. I love the chews though, they're so cute. Actually my my least favorite part about Wind Waker was that every time there was a monster that showed up, this scary ass music would play and be No, that was that was Twilight Princess. <laughs> that was Twilight Princess. Wind Waker was another set of music and it was scary as well. So every time the chews would pop up, I'd think oh, there's something really scary there and then the chews would just go blah, blah, blah. <laughs> You're like, oh, and I'm like dang it. I was freaking out for nothing. Ah, uh, you get all salty. Like, why do you have to do this to me? Ah, uh, yeah. Even though Choo Choo's just annoy me, because when there's like a large group of enemies in one city and Choo Choo's are like, like it's funny seeing the Choo Choo's next to a fire with moblins and bokoblins. Oh my and god. I'm like, Choo Choo's are just like chilling there, but like they got the, like, the electric ones and like, the <laughs> fire ones, and it's just annoying when they set you on fire. They're fire Choo's? Yeah, there's fire chews. I don't remember fire chews in... Uh, no, I'm gonna die. Um, it might be a new thing, because you got, yeah. Yeah, you got electric choo-choos, and you got fire choo-choos. And they're both really annoying, because obviously you get, like, the really fat ones, and then they jump, and then fire just spurts everywhere in Aww. its direction, you're like, I hate you! I remember the electric chews. Yeah, I remember, because even that in, um... What was it? Link Between Worlds. They only had, like, electric choo-choos. At least I think they, yeah, they had to be choo-choos. Because they had the regular ones and they had electric ones. Yeah, I think... I honestly can't remember the ones in Wind Waker. But I know, I don't believe they had, um, in Majora's Mask. Uh, oh, did you know that the DLC is actually gonna come out and you can wear Majora's Mask? Yeah, like the first DLC oh. pack, you can get a Korok mask, you get a uh, Majora's mask, you get uh, Hylian ghost armor, which are like, they look like the ghost Ooh. armor from Wind Waker, and you fight with like the big clunky ghost like swords. Dude, that'd be sick! Uh huh. Um, I know, because I wanted to buy the expansion pass. But, like, the expansion pass is $20, but in five friends, like, oh, you need to buy blah, blah, blah. Like, this does not include the price for future items. I'm like, well, that's crap. I'm going to pay $20 for this expansion pass. Not Wait, what? Not how much the DLC is going to cost. Yeah. You know, it's really annoying. That's kind of dumb, in my opinion. Mm-hmm.
don't get me wrong, I love Nintendo, and if I had a Switch or a Wii U at some point, I would definitely probably be one of those people that sold my souls and be like, I'm going to get all of the Amiibos right. and all of the DLC. Because I've done that with certain games before. But, like, it's different on Steam, I guess, because during the Steam sales, I have, like, all of the DLC and the expansions for Skyrim. Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's a little wreck! Whoa! The erect tower. Oh, so many erect towers. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, I don't know, cause like it's like the expansion passes, like you get to, like you'll have options for DLC one and DLC two, but then yeah. it's like a watch they're gonna add extra pricing to it, and then it's just gonna be like here, low croc. Uh, no. I'm gonna be honest. The in Majora's Mask, the crook seedling the sapling mm -hmm. was the scariest yeah <laughs> it was the scariest and that was like the first one you got and that was like the one you used the most yeah and uh, oh, oh have you heard about the the story behind that mm -mm. supposedly it's a dead crook seedling oh. and you're just wearing his face oh that's and when i yeah when i found out about that i'm like ah oh, man Ah! Oh no. This is gross. It, it pooped all over it. Yay, now you got the map for the plateau. Whee! But like it says, uh, the expansion pass is supposed to have the trial of the sword. Here is path mode. Trial of the sword. I'll explain it more after all this cutscene stuff. But then they have hard mode, trap and medallion. Yeah, you get Majora's Mask. You get... Uh, Minna's helmet. Oh, Minna. Yeah, Phantom Armor, which looks cool. Tingle's outfit. Oh my god. <laughs> and Korok Mask. Try to remember. Remember. I love the fact that even in the cutscenes, it'll show him what he's wearing. Huh. You're at least 116 years old, at the very least. Yeah. Yeah, I think, yeah, I guess, like, uh, like, it's not even adult. It's <laughs> this game, you had a chance to, like, play through again, and I hate Linkle. I hate Linkle so much. I hate the idea of her, um, but I really wish you could play through as Linkle. Mm -hmm. They could have come up with a better name. But, <laughs> and um, and Man-Zelda. Oh, Let's cool. call him... Zelos. Zelos. That at least is cool. Zelos sounds like it'd be a cool name. For, I'm like, Linkle! Linkle! Why Linkle? Linkle is annoying. We I could have it. her be Lila instead of Linkle. Right? Oh, freaking Linkle. Wait. Even though I do like the, her. Don't I have process. to go through and set the. Uh, well, the old man's like gonna go back down there. You can just do that right now, honestly. You don't need the old man to tell you. Okay, how do we do it? Because then you don't have that you one less you having to climb a freaking tower. Stamp. Oh, no, you gotta set it up a different way. Hold on, go back. I'm trying to think how you do it. Nope, you don't whistle. Don't whistle. Whistle. Ignore me. Uh no. Hold on. I don't need you to throw your weapon. I'm trying to remember which button you press to actually use your ability to um, you gotta, like, take a picture. Hold on, let me see if I can take it. Yeah. I'm trying to remember it. Go for it, man. Uh, no, no. <laughs> I'm just gonna press everybody. Everybody! Everybody. Uh, because I don't. Nope. We're not doing that. My arrows! My arrows! Yeah, my not, blue eyes! My blue eyes! <laughs> Uh, oh my god, I'm so sorry. I think, to our viewers. I think you actually do have to talk to the old man, maybe. This old man. Because I can't remember how to activate it. It's been a while. It's That's been fair. a while. Fine. Uh, 
Look and then up. after you talk Climb. to the old man, uh, yeah, I can tell you more details about this expansion pack. Yes, please do. So I'm curious because I don't think they even mentioned what the like if the Majora's Mask does anything. Like, I can't but, imagine it does anything super helpful, but at the same time, it'd still be kind of cool. Well, the Korok Mask it does. It's supposed to like show where all the Koroks are near you. Ah. So it makes it easier. Are there to find any all the like? What was it? Um, side quests that would deal with something similar to Majora's Mask? Uh, God dang it! Oh ho! What's up? My boy, it was him with how I did. Why's the tower here, Lee? Why's the tower? It's no way right. This tower and others just like it have erected across the land, <laughs> one after another. Um, oh. is this your doing? Why, quiet, old man. Oh. <laughs> It's almost as though a long dormant power has awoken quite suddenly. Don't you agree? God damn it, old man! <laughs> if you do not mind me asking, did anything odd occur while you were atop that tower? That Don't you think tower? something sexual? I heard a voice. <laughs> Wait! Damn uh, it, I pressed B. You need not conceal the truth from me. Truth be told, I saw the whole thing unfold from afar. I was watching. What a creep! I'm Santa! <laughs> Santa oh, knows oh, you're oh. He knows when you're awake. Oh. Although I w could not hear anything, I did see you react as if you heard something coming from the direction of the castle. You <coughs> 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 the nail on the head, did I? <coughs> Psychic Santa. Psychic Santa? No. I see. That. Well, that is unfortunate. <coughs> well, then. That sucks. Tell me, old man. <laughs> like, what do you know, old man? I think you're hiding things from me. I assume you caught sight of that atrocity enshrouding the castle. The castle. The castle. That calamity began in. One hundred years ago, the vile entity brought the kingdom of Hyrule to ruin. But then how is this all still around? I mean... It appeared suddenly and destroyed everything in its past. So many innocent lives were lost in its wake. Uh, for a century, the very symbol of our kingdom has managed to contain that evil. Uh, but really, <laughs> Oh, Chinese, coming back to hit me. <laughs> if best you're building a strength for the moment, it will unleash its blight upon the land. Like an open wound. Ganon's blight! Uh oh <laughs> It would appear that moment is fast approaching. Oh my. Don't you admit it, Master Way? Huh? I must ask you, outrageous one, do you intend to make your way to the castle? I do! Yep, I had a feeling you would say that. Not that I don't know who you are, obviously. Here on this isolated plateau, we are surrounded on all sides by steep cliffs and no way down. No, I did not actually notice that. If you were to try and jump off, well, no death could be more certain or more foolish. You don't know that. I clearly see land beneath I just that see fog. For it, like, you don't know me, old man! <laughs> you don't know my life! <laughs> Of course, if you had a paraglider like mine, that would be quite another story. Paraglider? Give me that. <laughs> oh, I'll pique your interest, have I? He's like a shitty salesman. He's like, oh, you needed something? Well, wouldn't it be convenient if I had that? I ah, see I picked her in. See, yeah, I do. I did come soaring down here on my own set of three wings, you know. Ah, ah, ah. Worry not, I will happily agree to give you my paraglider. Not, but not for nothing, Master Wing. Boo! You're the worst Albert ever. I know, I am the worst one. Let's see now. How about I try to pull a bit of treasure that slumbers nearby? No, because you're Ganon, probably. He's Ganon all along. Dun, dun, dun. His beard is Ganon. <laughs> just his just beard. He's hiding his beard. Uh. Oops. Yeah, so now... Old I'm, man. You heard a voice. Now you gotta get the paraglider. You gotta follow the old man. And listen to what he has to tell you. Listen to him! Listen to him, Link! Me. 
Don't just follow me. Fine. But you're not moving. He's taking forever. You're too slow. Oh, either. I can walk slower a bit. <laughs> no, I can't walk slower. Aww. There are some games where you just gently like, tap the... <laughs> yeah, and you can... Up. You can just see their legs start to go. I can't remember what game it is that does that. Mm -hmm. I think I think it's one of the Harry Potter games. Mm -hmm. I love them because they're so trolly. Uh, do you see that erect towel over there? Actually, it's not a erect towel. Do you see that erect jump over there? It's a just like a tree on fire. Or a small volcano. Yeah, it looks like a small volcano. Yeah. And glow in the exact moment those towers rose up from the ground. Oh, did they now? It became glowing. Oh, oh. I would think, I would think such a place might house some sort of treasure. Wouldn't you agree? No. No? <laughs> <laughs> treasure for the paraglider. Fair exchange, I believe. Yeah, you do, because you're old. You don't know the value of this. <laughs> Go pick it. You don't know the value of my life. Well... I guess I'll go. Go on. Fetch me a treasure. You want this paraglider? I mean, I'm certain the treasure in there is worth more than a paraglider. I mean, heck, all you need is like two sticks and like some fabric and you can make a paraglider, but no. You don't know how to. Are there piranhas in any of these waters? No. Uh, the only thing you have to worry about is the Octorax. What? Octorax. Octorax are in. There's water Octorax, and then there's like a plant Octorax. And, and then there's, there's rock Octorax. Sounds. What? Rock Octorax? <laughs> Pretty much the rock Octorax. Those don't sound pleasant at all. No. But it's cool because if you have a rusty weapon, the rock ones, like they inhale everything. So you can just like throw your weapon, and it'll inhale it, and then it'll spew it back out, and it'll be like brand new. It's kind of interesting. Those sound kind of cool, so but I still kind of scary. Oh, yeah, because obviously if you get hit, well, you're dealing you're with consequences. You're dead and done, probably. Yeah. Depending on how many hearts you have. <laughs> you, can, you, you get a lot of hearts in this. Yeah. From what you've told me, yeah, I can see that. I want that chest. Well, you gotta do the shrine if you want the chest. And there's another chest. I want all of these. You gotta do this. Oh man, oh man, oh Oh man, oh! But before we start this, right, we're gonna cut this episode here. Alright. So, there. That's a good spot. Exactly. Right for right. the right. Gazing out at our erect tower. <laughs> put, put, put it somewhere. While he's dripping above. wet. Yes. Now put his, put the tower above his head. Like, I just want. It looks like that! It's <laughs> I'm here to party! I'm Link, and I'm here to party. This hat says party. This is a party. <laughs> this hat says party. <laughs> can you screenshot on your Nintendo Wii? Yeah, you can. <sighs> uh, you can do it on this. Easy. You just press. Capture taken! <laughs> Alright. We've got the thumbnail for this. Yes. <laughs> party uh, hat. Alright, see you later! Time.